Welcome everyone. Um, we thought we would uh, show you what the actual different sizes look like of your supers. Uh, now this here, there's a lot of questions about this. This here is uh, a full deep super typically used as either a brood box or a honey box or a honey super on top. Um, look this is probably the heaviest variation you could go with. It uh, is probably the most profitable if honey is what you're after. Uh, it takes the least amount of effort to get the most amount of honey out. Uh, however, that effort is very, very laborsome. The next step down, um, at least the, in these three that we're showing, is called the ideal, which is pretty much the half or almost, I'd say, two, two thirds of this full super. Much easier to carry, uh, much, much lighter. And, um, however, uh, percentage of the honey is much smaller as opposed to one of these. Then the next step down from that is a half, which realistically is almost an ideal but smaller still. Does it have its place? Yes, certainly. Depending if you're a young beekeeper that has no strength or perhaps elderly and does not uh, have the strength to carry uh, heavy frames anymore or heavy, bo uh, heavy boxes. Very, very good. However, you need to maintain lots of frames to get the same amount of honey. Um, so you do need to be careful when you're choosing uh, or selecting the sizes. I do want to show you the actual sizes. Now this is going to be metric. I do apologize for those in in America. Ah, oh, actually, I have managed to find a tape with both sizes. So that's the size that you're looking to get. Let me just go to focus on that. And that is the size of the full box. Please just pause the video to check out the size. That is the size of ideal, which is almost 15 centimeters. And that is the size of the half, which is 12 and a half. So hopefully that has cleared up a few things. If I can make a recommendation, if you are strong, have the will, go with one of these. Uh, certainly you'd want to have your brood box or two brood boxes with a full deep because the queen does like to lay um, in, a, in, a, in a circular motion so her nest would be if you've got two boxes would be like this across the two boxes uh, finds it quite the queens find it it's not that they can't do it but they find it a little bit more difficult to uh, to lay their eggs if you use the ideals or indeed the halves can be done but it's just not practical for them so if anything, always have at least one or two of the full size, and then you can stack whichever one you feel more comfortable with for your honey side, for your honey supers. Um, hopefully, you find that useful. If you did, please, uh, we invite you to subscribe to our channel. Um, give us feedback. We really do appreciate it, and um, hopefully, we'll see you next time. Have a good day. Bye.